What's going on guys? Welcome back to Nolan TCG and we are back here today with another episode of Sealed Only. So um, Sealed Only could actually be coming to an end pretty soon because, or at least this version of Sealed Only, we'll move back to doing like physical Sealed Only because our locals have started to reopen here in Australia. Um, uh, had our first locals on Tuesday night. Unfortunately we're not back to like full scale locals yet because they're only allowed to have like one card game per night essentially. So once we get back into the full swing of things, we will probably start doing physical sealed only again, so I wouldn't expect too many more episodes of this. Um, also something as well, next Sunday we are going to start the tournament for our um, Quarantine Cup. So like the playoffs will start. Over the course of the past few months while Locals has been out, I've been hosting like tournaments for everyone that does Locals online. Big thanks to Corey for helping me out with that one. But as Locals has now started to reopen, we're winding that back. Um, point scoring has ended, so we're moving into our playoff system. Uh, congratulations to Jake, who took home the ulti crush card for finishing first in the regular season. And now we have behind us the playmat that we have had custom made for the winner. We'll make sure we put this up the right way. But um, we do have a playmat here for whoever comes in first place at the end of our championship. Also, before we do get started as well, please do as always remember to jump down below and hit that subscribe button. We are always happy to have new people here. Also, um, jump over to Cowboy for Game. They're down in the description below. They have some sealed only openings as well as some podcasts and things. But let's get started. So, um, originally I planned on opening Duel over... Oh no, the Duel... The one from years and years ago that has Lagia in it. But I couldn't find it anywhere on any online pack opener, so our choice is a Eternity Code or their Photon Shockwave. Um, we'll probably go with Eternity Code just because it has Archisaur, Secret Ratios are a little bit better, and um, Crocker Shark. We kind of need that as well. We can get some Parallel Exceeds, but put it in for 15 packs. Let's see what we get. Come on. Okay, we need to get that Archisaur. A Protoss. Okay, I'm not sure how playable that one is, but I guess if we're all playing archetypes, I can kind of come to advantage, I guess. Those Arch Nemesis cards. But let's keep rolling. We want to see three Parallel Exceed, preferably, and we want to see some copies, or a copy, at least, of Crocker Shark and... Or Crocker Dragon, whatever it's called, and the Animador and Archer Sword. Um, but I don't know how easy this is gonna be. This could be a bit of a mistake. Instead, we probably should have gone for something that buffs up our. Ah, uh, no. Nah. Buffs up our, uh, our main deck. I guess we don't really need anything else other than this stuff, so I guess it's just kind of wild opening until we can hit an Archer Sword or something like that. Guess this is the the downside of sealed only when we're opening packs trying to chase secret rares. Ah, come on, just show me something good. Nope, 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 nope. Let's just flip everything this time. Oh, I'm told ultra rare, but not an ultra rare we need. Oh, there's parallax seed there. That's solid. Flip them all again. Second parallax seed there. Maybe maybe I flip them all again and get a third parallax seed. No, but we'll get the Arch Nemesis. Um, we could definitely look at putting those in, just to kind of spice things up a bit. Um, nope. Come on. Nope. Okay, last one of this batch of 15 before we open five more. Ah, uh, nah. Okay, let's, uh... How many XC did we pull from that? Um, we saw... We definitely saw two. We get one, two... Did we see a third? Nope, we did not see a third. Okay, let's go back. We're gonna crack open five more packs of this. Well, let's roll. Here we go. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. No, okay. Oh, uh, no. That's not good. Three packs left. We gotta at least see a secret here, surely. Surely we have to see a secret rare. I didn't want to see that secret rare. Ah. Well, I guess we got the third parallel exceed, but Deep Sea Aria is the secret rare that we got. That's not great. That's not great at all. Oi. Come on. Nah. Bummer. Bummer. I guess. 
We have the X Seed, we have the Arch Nemesis. Let's get over to Dueling Book and we'll update the deck. Okay, so we are back over on Dueling Book now. Um, we have updated the deck. Essentially, we've just added in the five good cards. Um, yeah, I kind of figured it was the best way to go to just kind of add them all in and see what happens, I guess. I don't normally like playing above 40 cards, but this could be fun. But starting us off with our main deck, we have one copy of Arch Nemesis Ekastos. Uh, one copy of Protoss, three Ash Blossom, triple Baby Cerasaurus, uh, one Prankatops, double Ghost Bell, one Giant Rex, one Aeolo, triple Miscellaneousaurus, one Quartless, triple Exceed, one PT Tyranodon, uh, triple Oviraptor, triple True King Agnimazod, one True King Lissasagem, one Tyranno Infinity, triple Ultimate Conductor Tyranno, one Double Evolution Pill, one Dragonic Diagram, Triple Fossil Dig, Triple Lost World, one Terraforming, two Twin, one Impermanent Judgment. Then for our extra deck, we have the one Omega, one Trish, one Vermilion Dragon Mech for our nines. I still can't make this Omega, so I don't know why it's still in here, but I just keep leaving it in there. Then after that, we've got the Dweller, the one Souk, we got one Castell. I also can't make the Souk. Again, I've just kind of left this stuff in here. And then we've got the Silent Honor Arc, we've got Utopia, we've got Tornado Dragon, we've got True King of All Calamities. Then for our links, Beat Cop, Curious, Decode, Link, uh, Link Karibo, and Underclock. So um, one of the big things is we can make Link Karibo now if we open like Miscellaneous Forest Parallel Exceed and like garbage. We can like discard that, go into the Aeolo, and then make the Exceed underneath it. And then we can go into something like Dweller or Tornado Dragon, just like stun our opponent out. But for our extra deck, or our side deck, sorry, we've got double Denko, double Ghost Ogre, the third Twin Twisters, uh, one Anti-Spell, one Different Dimension Ground, triple Grand Horn of Heaven, triple Quaking Mirror Force, and double Solemn Strife. But that will wrap us up here today on our episode of Sealed Only. So as always, I have said it early, but please remember to hit that subscribe button. We are always happy to have new people. Uh, next Sunday will be the first round, of, well, the first round will start of our um, championship for our Quarantine Cup. So do check that one out. Uh, we are probably going to be doing some stuff on Twitch for related to Duel Links, so if you are interested in Duel Links content, head over to Twitch and check that out. And as always, I've been Ben from Nolan TCG, and have a good afternoon, everybody.